let's disable ads on Redmi 15. So first of all, we're going to go to the app drawer and we're going to start with app vault over here. In this case, in order to get rid of ads, we can tap on these three dots that we have in the top right corner. If your uh, app vault looks a little bit different, then most likely it is not updated. So uh, we're going to go to these three dots and then open the manage services. Over here, we can disable app suggestions and promotion. And also you can go to notifications and you can turn off notifications of the app vault over here. I believe we don't really need these notifications. Then we're going to go to downloads. Tap on these three dots in the top right corner and let's go to settings. And over here, we can disable show recommended content and then press OK. Let's go back. Next. Uh, another app that we're going to go to is the uh, Xiaomi video over here. Now, in this case, let's swipe up once in order to uh, get rid of it. In this case, we want to go to profile over here in the bottom right corner and then tap on this setting icon in the top right corner. And here we can disable personalized recommendations. Let's see if we have, there is also popular today, so we can go over here and turn it off. Let's go back. There's also scan for a new local video, so we can turn that off as well. And that should be, that should be it, I believe. All right. So now let's go back. Let's exit. And another app that we're going to go to is the MI browser, the Xiaomi browser. In this case, we need to tap on our um, person icon over here in the uh, bottom right corner, I think I updated it by accident. Over here in the top right corner, we have settings. And in here, we can, for example, disable games on the navigation bar. We can also disable news notifications. And let's see, I believe there is something more. Over here, we can go to advanced. There is also ad blocker, which you can use. And over here, we have show ads, which we can disable. All right, so that should be it in this app. Let's exit. Now we're gonna go to music. Let's wait a couple of seconds. All right, so over here I need to grant these permissions to proceed. Let's close this. And we're gonna tap on these two sliders in the top left corner and then go to settings. Now in these settings, you should be able to disable permanent notifications. And then we're going to also go to advanced settings. And in here we have show ads. So we can disable that. Again, show online recommendations on startup. We can disable that as well. And personalized recommendations. All right. I think that should be all. We're going to go back again. We're going to exit the app. Next, security. And in here, we can tap on the setting icon in the top right corner. Here we can disable receive recommendations, go to cleaner. And over here, we can also disable recommendations. And I think that's all over here. So we're going to exit. All right. And then we're going to also go to themes. I believe this is the last app. Let's keep the ad. We're going to go to my account in the bottom right corner and then settings in the upper right corner. Let's close this. And let's go to settings. And we can disable ads and personalized recommendations. All right. I believe that's all that we have on this smartphone. Let me just quickly double check. If I missed something, we went to security. All right. So in terms of app that, apps, that's all. But in addition to that, what I want you to do is go to settings. And then in these settings, we're going to go to notifications and status bar. Then we're going to go to app notifications. It should be sorted by time received. So uh, we can switch that in a second. If you have get apps, then you can disable the, not uh, the notifications. And we're going to switch from time received to. Well, I think we cannot really sort it alphabetically, unfortunately. All right, so we're going to stick with that how it is. So we're going to scroll down and we can disable notifications, for example, from the maybe with from the browser, definitely from MI video and music. 
and from themes. We can disable from themes as well. The rest, I think, is just quite optional. Yeah. So that should be all. In case you get some annoying not uh, notifications from other apps, then you can just go over here later on and disable. So for example, if you have some notifications from gallery or file manager, then you can disable them over here in case they are bothering you. So that should be it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe.